Welcome to another edition of Small Talk for You. This morning I wanted to take a brief look at Object Studio and take a look at one additional thing you need to know about loading things in Object Studio. There's kind of two ways to load things. You can either go in here to the Parcel Manager, which will bring up the thing that you're familiar with if you use VisualWorks, and that's the Parcel Manager tool. You can load things this way. And the more classic way to load things, and the way a lot of the applications that are interesting in Object Studio get loaded, is through file load applications. So for instance, if you want the mapping tool, which is one of the new tools in Object Studio, or the modeling tool, which is another one, you pick that here, you hit load, and you get a little box here, which is probably off screen, so I'll move that over, and you see that it's loading. Now, interestingly enough, it's loading a parcel, so again, if you knew what you were doing, you could load it through the parcel manager, but you can load it conveniently through this little tool. Now, interestingly enough, one of the interesting things about Optic Studio is this tool down here is not actually the transcript window. If you're familiar with VisualWorks or with Visual Age, you're going to see this little part is the transcript, not in Optic Studio. This is where applications get loaded. So if I double click on this, I'm going to start the mapping tool. And that's the way a lot of things in Optic Studio work. So you should be aware of that. If you actually want the transcript, it's one of the tools. And you go here, pull down transcript, and you get the system transcript right there. And you can see it's bringing in all the information about the parcels that got loaded, which is what you would expect. So it's kind of a brief overview of some of the things you need to know about Object Studio, how to load applications in and what applications there might be. In some future screencasts, I'll probably go through some of these things like the modeling and mapping tool. So it's better for today. Until next time, have fun with whatever small talk you're using.